You won't believe how dumb these cops are. What are you doing, man? Oh, pull your gun. There's no gun. Ken, what are you doing? Put Me? Put your hands on the way. Put your hands on dash. What are you doing with your gun out, man? Right, no what lawful basis was there for you to ask for her ID? Was that dumb? <laughs> I don't know. Um, in order to detain somebody, what do you have to have legally? Do you know? I do not know the law legally. This is not a Wait, from a the comedy police, movie. but these are supposed to be cops who should know and protect our rights, but they don't what? even know the laws. In this video, we've gathered some not so smart officers Ooh. doing crazy stuff that will seriously make you cringe. So you thought there was an auto accident, so you came up with a gun. A security camera at a store caught a really bad situation where a cop in Wilmington, Delaware, named Samuel Waters, okay. went up to a guy for no reason, grabbed him and then banged his head a bunch of times on the plexiglass by the cash register. Why? The beating continued off camera, but now there's new body cam footage from Officer Waters that shows what happened right after this violent incident. My face, bro. You just smashed my face into the glass for nothing. Huh? You yeah. just great slam me down. Look what you just did, man. And all I'm asking you is what is going on? Why are you arresting me? Right. I told you, I no, was detaining you. You, you seem to turn around. No, you didn't you want to listen. Tell me anything. You're, you didn't even read my rights or okay. nothing. You didn't tell me what was going on. You just sort of assaulted okay. me, dude. Look at my Stop. face. Stop. Look at my face, man. The guy didn't do whatever the cop said, and that's totally okay because it's his right. This is why Officer Waters think it's okay to be aggressive and violent. Yo, why would you just go up to him, grab him, and smash his face into the glass, though? What? Island. But he should have told the guy what he did wrong or what the investigation was about. The guy didn't have to answer any of Officer Waters' questions. You're fing going down, dude. You just assaulted me for no reason. Okay. <laughs> okay. You just assaulted me for no reason, dude. I wanted to have a conversation with you, and you nah, got squirrel. You, didn't. you wasn't trying to conversate nothing, dude. You was trying to assault me. Oh, that's cool. messed well, so up. Maybe bro. next time I say, put your hands in the wall, well, you'll right listen. In there. Instead of being a in the air. My hands were in the air. Now you just All right. assault me. This guy just f***ing assaulted me, man. I'd like to speak to some superiors. <laughs> he just assaulted me. It's all on camera in there, dude. I see another look, set of hands in the car. Come on. Let's go. Why are you trying to twist and, twist and break my wrist? Yeah, Yo, why would he do that with his body cam on, though? Like, is he dumb? Like, is he actually dumb? Probably, because he's one of those fall down, see you, mother... Hmm? What is it? No idea. He don't want to tell me his name. My fingerprint scanner's not working. I tried to have a conversation with him, and he broke back, man, no fighting. Oh, really? Yeah, so he's angry, got his head slammed in. No, 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 bro. No, no. To say he's a cop, a cop, yeah? He's actually dumb, bro. You did it in a shop. Shops have cameras. Are you dumb? Yo. He's saying that, bro, he was talking to him, and a fight broke out. He went up to him and smashed his head into glass, bro. One idiot. Into a wall, but... Wow. That's all you gotta do. Whatever. So, just figured I'd get some extra hands in case he decides to do something dumb. The man sued Officer Waters, saying he violated Obviously. his rights and used a racial slur during the arrest. Officer Waters got charged with eight counts, including two felonies in this incident and another earlier that month. And then you can wait, see wait, 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 wait. You got charged with eight counts, but did, did he get fired? Did he get fired or like... Did he get fired? Charged with eight counts? Bro, that's crazy, man. Right there, the suspect trying to get into somebody's property or still trying to hide, but uh, doing a very, very poor job of it right there. LAPD coming to a stop. Oh, come on, guys. He's right there. <laughs> the, the officer's running right by him. They're, they're going right by him. Angie, our pilot, yeah, today, Bobby, works. 102, trying to tell the officers that this suspect is right there. And uh, and again, you just saw that. It nearly oh works. my goodness, I just feel so bad for those officers making their way back now. <laughs> it's the blue car. There we go. Somebody's get somebody's getting the information. Somebody's got to they be getting still the information. Can't find it. Keep coming around, Ange. Keep coming around. Keep coming around. That suspect, unbelievable. Oh my God. They, we're watching this live, and you have to understand that these officers they don't know what the information that we know. <laughs> but again, that LAPD helicopter just arriving. There you go. Some of those officers must be getting that yeah, information. You there you go. There you go. You're close. And now that suspect going into custody. Wow. Wow. And oh, wait. Did you even see? There you go. And now that suspect going into custody. Wow. No, yo. At this point, it's like they're doing it on purpose, bro. At this point, it's like they're doing it on purpose, bro. Wow. And...
They haven't seen him yet. This is unbelievable. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh, there we go. Uh, oh my god. So you thought there was an auto accident, so you came up with a gun. In Arizona, there, right? a cop pulled over a parked car after heard reports about a car crash. Okay. Right away, the officer pulled out a gun on the two guys inside. Check out how messed up this situation gets. That's scary. The ruckus, sir. Oh, there it goes. Transmission's as as, better? As soon as, as soon as he comes out. It's all better now? What? Shut it! Bro, this is making me like on edge. What is shutting? Come on boots? up here! Hey, the car is hot, man. Just trying to get some water out of it. Whoa, whoa, what the Hey! Man? What are you doing, man? Oh, pull your gun. There's no gun! Freaking... Ken, what are you doing? Me? Put your hands on the wheel, put your hands sure. on the dash. What are you doing with your gun out, man? Right, there's no threat. There's no threat. Got it. I'll tell you in a second. Holster your weapon, man. All right? Don't Why would he put his gun right? out? Keep your hands on the dash, keep your hands on the thing. All right. on the 911 call, all right? Okay. I'll explain all that to you in a second, all right? Because we're trying to get water, right? Okay, exactly. I don't know what you're trying to do right now. But you guys are, you're over here with the door open. All right? Yeah, we need to check it. Wait, 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 wait. So he's pulled a gun out because they got a door open. And he don't know what they're doing. So the cop don't know what they're doing. I used to put his. Okay. Listen, look at that. Is it illegal to have the door open? Cool, man. So calm Is down. It... Let's start over. You call. You put your gun. Away. Let's no, 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 calm down. Put your guns away. Calm... Don't worry about my gun. Put your gun out. away. Our hands are up. You don't tell me what to do. Right? Put your gun away. Why has he got his gun out? Why did the officer choose to pull out a gun on the guys? If it was really just a car accident, this officer might have committed a serious crime by pulling out his gun and pointing it at these people when there wasn't any real threat. And to top it off, he asked for a do-over while still holding his gun and telling them to keep their hands up. It's hot. We have to leave it going. The transmission is hot. Okay. I'm not moving my hands. Fair enough. What are you doing out here? Whatever I want. Am I breaking the law? I'm not breaking any laws. I need some water. Move. Anything. No, he's just gone up to a random car and asked him what he. Bro, so he has he has no clue what they're doing. They're not breaking any laws. He's just gone up to the car with the gun out. Yo, make it make sense. Make it make sense. That, that, bro, that makes no sense. Okay. You guys involved in that collision out here? No. No. It came out as a does red it, car, does it look two like, white males. No. Does so it, it look like a collision? Prison. Take a look at the collision. I haven't walked out there, bro. Okay, well, 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 well then do the investigation. The car, we'll right? keep our hands up here. You check the I'm car. I'm here trying to figure out what the hell is going on. Okay. All right. All right. I take a I, piss. That's one thing. You. I'm out five feet away. I'm telling you exactly what to do. You're not doing it. That's why this came out. I don't listen to tyrants, man. You got your gun pulled. Look at you. This don't make me a tyrant, bro. Yes, it does. Yeah, it does. We didn't pull Wait, what does what does tyrant mean? What's it? What's a tyrant? Chat. What's a tyrant? What's a tyrant? What does that mean? Anyone know? <laughs> does no one know? <laughs> no one is what a tyrant is. <laughs> like an overlord. Like bad, bad people with powers. Okay. I don't listen to All tyrants, right. man. You got your gun pulled. Look at it's you. This don't make me a tyrant, bro. Yes, it does. Yeah, it does. Okay. We didn't pull a gun on you. Listen, let's start over, man. What do you? What's your business out here right now? <laughs> Anything I want to do, a free American citizen, exercise any right so I can. So you weren't involved in an auto accident, right? Yeah. Why don't you take a look around and do your own investigation? Why does he have his gun out still? Okay, thank you. I don't need to talk He's to you about that. Fair enough, man. All right, there it you is go. What it is. You do need to give me your license. You swore an oath to the Constitution, right? Your driver's license. For what? And this is not a traffic stop. For what? Huh? For what? Because I'm on what's called an investigative stuff, Then you right? tell me you're a reasonable, articulable suspicion, and I'll give you whatever you want. Whoa, okay, big woods! So you guys are right, red car, two white males, surveying the prison. All right, I'm out here on 911 call. I'm doing an investigative what? stop right now, okay? So, I haven't had the chance to talk to you. Was there a crime? No, yo, he just made that shit up, bro. He just made that shit up, bro. Crime? Is cameras a there's crime? There's possibly a crime, all right? So, all right. I need your ID. You got to figure out if there's a crime first. Do you Wilson. have articulable suspicion? 45 eight. Can you articulate your suspicion that we've committed? There's no crime, man. Hands are Come up on. here. Yo, we have, drop the we ego we and just go, go bro. So can go back to the you can do whatever okay. you want, right. man. Drop the ego and just go, line. man. We'll keep our hands up here. We don't want to get shot or nothing. That's not cool, man. Yeah, what? that's, that's not gun. cool. Come up with a gun. Our Olsen, what's your bad you thought number? there was an, So you're saying you thought there was an auto accident, and so you came up with a gun? <laughs> Yo, chat, that's not normal, is it? So even if they was involved in a car crash, why would he pull up with a gun? Out.
What? So every time there's a car crash incident, you pull up to the people involved in the car crash with your gun out? That don't make sense in my head, bro. That makes zero sense. Auto accident. So, so you thought there was an auto accident, so you came up with a gun. Get your hand off my car, man. <laughs> this cop is pretty tense. What this officer really needs is more training and to go on some ride-alongs for a bit. It's obvious that after some arguing, the cop figured out he messed up and just tried to play it cool. Yeah, you, but you eventually, could tell. he completely changed how he was acting. Well, I'm out with a red vehicle. That's not the house. Take pictures of the person out here. Uh, right now, it's all I got so far. Doing lawful activity. Oh, so that's all you got is that we... Is you're saying now it's not an auto accident, but somebody took pictures of a prison? I already told you what it is, man. I'm not going to repeat myself. He's changing okay. his story. No, you told him what all it fairness, is. fairness, I'll repeat myself. Okay. So is it illegal to take pictures? Here's what it is, all right? I had a crime, I have a report of a crime committed. Because of your, your non-compliance, I have not had any opportunity to investigate it, okay? I'm gonna stand here with you. Mm -hmm. Once the other unit gets here, I'm gonna have, have him stay with you guys. I'll continue on my investigation, okay. all right? Can, can not expect to run into a red car with two white males <laughs> surveying the prison as I'm on the way to the exact call that I'm out here for, okay? Okay, can you I, tell I me that? can't be any more clear than that. All right, all right. So we'll just hang out. So is the crime- right over. I, I respect you all right, guys. All right, all right. Rights. Well, thank you, thank you. Let's keep it that way. Let's keep it right. I never pointed my gun at you, but I got my gun out, and I'm, by law, more than entitled to do that. Can I clarify one thing? Is the is the 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 suspicion of crime is it an auto accident or public photography? Which one? It would be hit and run, actually. Okay, so an auto accident. Oh, yo. It'd be hit and run. Okay, okay, cool, cool. So it has nothing to do with public photography then. No. Okay. Cause you said surveying no, a prison. I'm here. You keep that thing out, man. I'm, yeah. I'm can't. I got a camera. Yeah. I'm, no, I ain't gonna lie. He's just making up stories, bro. Like he's not making up stories, but he's changing the story too much, bro. He's changing the story too much. You know what I'm saying? He like I, I don't get people like that. Just be on with your day, man. You know what I'm saying? Just trying to clarify. I, I what's up. I'm just trying Make to clarify because it sounds like two separate things: surveying a prison and an auto accident. I'm trying to put together what you're trying to. You well, know. There was that lead up. And then there was an auto accident, and then there was a hit and run. Okay, so the car <laughs> itself was hit and run. Okay, but okay, not just surveying the prison. Okay? Now that we've de-escalated, right. can I put you my hands down? Survey. Can I put my hands down now that we've de-escalated? Sure. All right. This officer sees an accident not as a mistake, but as a reason to act like a bully. When he realized there was no real danger, you could hear the adrenaline in his voice fade. Yo, oh. you can tell he he knew he like fucked up though. Like you could tell, you know how like he, he he put like the way he put his gun back, the way he tried changing it, the way he's like, you know what I'm saying? Like he was like, okay, maybe I came a bit too heated, mate. Hopefully, he faced the consequences he deserved, or learned a lesson in training to become a better cop. It's actions like these Mad. that make a lot of people dislike cops. That would be scary cops. though. This 17-year-old. Bro, year like old... actually think about it, chat. You're in a car and a cop just comes up with his gun out, bro. That would be scary. Like, you should have a valid reason to come up to the car with a gun out, bro. Because that would, bro, that would be scary, man. Kid knows his rights. He got the attention of a cop when he was hanging around the store. The officer stopped him, thinking he looked like someone they were after. The teenager then educated the cop about the rights of civilians. At the teenager? E hey, who? The e six store? Oh. E-cigarettes? How old are you? 17. You're 17? Where are you coming from? The wreck. The what? The wreck. The rec center? Yeah. What's your name? Why? Because I'm asking you for your name. No, I don't have to give out my name. Yeah, you do, because I'm investigating a suspicious person, and you have to give me your name. Suspicious ain't a crime, though. Uh, yeah, it is. It's being suspicious is a crime? Yeah, if you're doing something, can you just step off away from the road? These people drive crazy. Yo, is it normal for most people in America to know, like, the laws like this? Because, like, you know, if I got pulled over, I would have no clue what's a crime. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know how he's saying suspicious is a crime? I would, e I would even know if it's suspicious is a crime, bro. You know what I'm saying? I would have zero clue. I would have zero clue. They could pull me over and make stuff up, and I'd be like, oh, okay. Oh, looks like I'm going to uh, jail for the night then. Well, I had a oh, most don't know laws? Oh, okay. Depends on the people. Yeah, I suppose it's good to know, because then you just, like, you'd be like me. They could just make stuff up and just send you to, you know what I'm saying? Like, bro, I'm telling you right now, bro, if a cop pulled me over, I would have no clue what's right and what's wrong. I'd have no clue. They, they would ask for my ID. I, I would just give them the ID because I don't know if I should or shouldn't. You know what I mean? Wait, really, Ryder? Feeling y'all will come. Say what? That's I had a feeling y'all will come bother me once I see you. Yeah, I just stay in the red. I was looking right at you. I just came from the red. Yeah, if I got pulled over, it, my first word would be lawyer, lawyer. Lawyer, 
Uh, anything they say to me, I'd be like, lawyer, 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 lawyer. lawyer. That, that's what I would say. That's what I would say. The teenager informs the officer that he just came from a recreation center, and there's no good reason for the cop to question him. He's totally correct, but the cop isn't giving up. Now, she's throwing random questions at him, hoping he'll say something incriminating. What is your name? I don't need to give out there. I didn't, be, I didn't commit no crime. How do I know that? You don't need to know that. I know that. <laughs> you call your sergeant? I don't need to call my sergeant. Yes, you do. For what? Because you got to. It's your policy. You better do it. Why? What hey. policy? Okay. But I know the law. I'm not dumb. I didn't say you were dumb. Is so it because he's 17? Stupid? I'm not. I'm so telling you. Call your sergeant. You want to talk to my call sergeant? Call your sergeant. For yes. what reason? Because I asked. I'm, I asked you. That's your oh, policy, you ain't it? it? No. Happens. Yes, it is. You want to tell me that for real? Are you sure? 100%. Yeah. What's your badge with him? 246. Yo, this is a small name? ass 17 year old, bro. The cop wants to know the teenager's name, but he says no. He's allowed to do that. The law says you can refuse to answer if the officer doesn't have a reasonable, articulable suspicion okay. or probable cause to detain, interrogate, or pat down a person. Then the boy flips things around and asks the officer for her identification. All right. Y'all niggas is bugging, bro. I ain't doing a damn. That's fine. I'm just telling you. Somebody called about someone that somewhat matches their description, but what I see your What store did you say blue. again, please? So what? What store did you say? The E6 store. And E6 where is it at? It's on this road. I came from that away. Okay, I believe you. Then why you keep questioning me if I haven't done nothing? Well, now that I'm looking at your pants, I see they're black. And I was told they were blue pants, so. Well, there you go. I mean, no reason to. Uh. Get all hyped up with me. No, I just asked you why you. Okay, do you still want to speak with my sergeant? I'm, am I free to go? Yeah, I'm gonna give you my card. Okay. We don't want your card. Sergeant's name. I'm gonna write it on here for we you. We don't want your okay. card. So you can reach out to him if you need to. Now that the cop realizes she stopped the wrong person and the boy isn't scared of her, she starts coming up with small excuses. She tries to calm the teenager by giving him her card. Yo, I ain't gonna lie. If you was told the description blue pants, why are you even gonna stop someone and waste both your times with somebody that's got black pants on? You know what I'm saying? Like, why even... Like, bro, that time you're wasting is more time of the actual guy getting away. Bro. But he's not naive enough to see this as just a mistake. And he, he's still being Don't cautious. Don't worry about that. I'm not from out here. All right. Well, I'm not from out here either. And it's not bothering me. You didn't get the car? Thank you. Okay, sir. You have a good day. Yup. Okay, man. Okay, okay. Okay, man. 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 Okay, man